Well, good afternoon, Steve. It's day three down here in Nashville at the SEC tournament, but it's the first day for fans like these to see their Kentucky Wildcats in action. They will open up play tonight against Alabama for what will be the third meeting of the season between the two teams. Despite being the number two seed, the Kentucky Wildcats are the heavy favorites to win this year's SEC tournament, and their road begins Friday night against the Alabama Crimson Tide. The Cats are 2-0 this season versus the Tide and beat them by 25 just two weeks ago in Lexington. But this time around, the Tide feel they are a different team and are more prepared to battle the Big Blue. We're a better team, and... Um... We've also matured. You know, with that comes, you know, just having experience playing in this league. So, um, you know, Kentucky's a good team, and they do what, we, what they do. But at the same time, I got complete faith in our coaching staff and teammates that we have more than enough, you know, to, to go out there and give them, uh, give, us, give them our best shot. So at least according to Alabama, the Crimson Tide are playing pretty good basketball right now. But Kentucky is playing arguably its best basketball of the season entering tonight. Now fans are already filling the streets here in downtown Nashville. Tanner Hesterberg has more from some fans at Fanfare on Broadway. A lot going on inside Bridgestone Arena, and as you can see, a lot going on outside here at SEC Fanfare. City officials have blocked off this section of Broadway here in downtown, so fans are free to shoot some hoops of their own, enjoy music, and participate in numerous activities. I'm just out here having fun, getting ready to go see Kentucky play in all the games. Um, we're gonna go see Kentucky play and have fun. We are going to go see the Kentucky, um, game Kentucky and basketball game and at the SEC just tournament. Fun and shooting baskets. Now coming up on Mountain News at 6, we'll take you to a University of Kentucky pep rally featuring a performance by Halfway to Hazard. Reporting in downtown Nashville, Tanner Hesterberg, back to you. Tanner, thank you very much. Now, Steve, a little bit later on Mountain News at 6, Tanner and I will both have more on the Cats and Tide as they battle it out to see who will play tomorrow in the SEC Tournament semifinals. Re reporting for Ryan T, Josh McKinney. Steve, back to you. Oh, we've got some crazy fans already. All right, Josh, thank you very much.